Hey guys, John Russell, 60 Seconds with a Surgeon. Yesterday, I had a patient who came in with swallowing problems, and she also had Hashimoto's thyroiditis, and she also had thyroid nodules. And she said, hey, could my swallowing problems come from the thyroid nodules or from my Hashimoto's thyroiditis? The answer to that question is yes, swallowing problems can come from thyroid nodules or Hashimoto's thyroiditis, especially if the nodules are big or if the nodules are in the wrong spot or if your Hashimoto's is pretty severe, meaning that your antibody levels are pretty high. In any of those situations, surgery or radiofrequency ablation or something to reduce the size or the impact of your thyroid on your esophagus and your windpipe might help you to feel better. But you can't undo treatment. And so the first thing that we start with is other things, meaning a lot of times we'll send people to have swallowing therapy before they'll have surgery or radiofrequency ablation. We'll also do things to try to reduce their antibody titer if that's something that we feel like there's obvious targets that they can improve. We do everything that we can before we go to surgery, but for some patients that really is what they need so that they can have their swallowing feel better.